Covering Clay County, there are now 46 new officers officially sworn to serve and protect students. Before tonight's school board meeting, the first class of the Clay County School Police Department, along with Police Chief Kenneth Wagner, formally took the oath during a special ceremony. Board members also voted to formally approve the policies of the police department. News for Jack's reporter Maggie Lorenz is live at Fleming Island High School. Maggie, we know this was the quick turnaround for the new police force to get ready for the school year. Joy, a few months ago, many were saying it couldn't be done. In fact, during his speech tonight to those new officers, the police chief himself lightheartedly pointed out how new his department is, but he said he's going to make it the best school police department in the state of Florida. We talked tonight to the officers who are working to make that happen. I'll turn this over to our chief of police, Kenneth Wagner. The first batch of Clay County Schools officers officially have their pins, but these are no rookies. Altogether, they have more than 900 years of law enforcement experience. Officer Hernandez moves. He is being pinned by his son, James. This officer has 31 years of experience and retired from the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office. I'm looking forward to working with small kids, looking forward to being an influence on the children, working with the staff at the school. I think that encouragement and that, uh, that motivation that I can give those children, so the outlook on police will be more positive. With the increasing prevalence of school shootings, these officers need to be equipped to handle active shooter situations. I'm ready, yes. Yes, I've got 31 years of law enforcement experience, a lot of training, so I'm absolutely ready. Of course, we pray that that never happens, but when the time comes if I have to do my job, I'm absolutely going to do that, protect the, the students of the, of the schools as, as well as the staff. Active shooter drills are one part of the training these officers have done every day since they started June 6th. Other drills include crisis de-escalation training and mental health first aid. First day for Clay County students is Tuesday, August 13th. Teachers go back next week and at tonight's meeting, a group of Clay County teachers from across the county begged school board members to keep fighting for the half cent sales tax and all new tonight at 11 where the school board is at in its battle against the Board of County Commissioners. Live in Fleming Island, Maggie Lorenz Channel 4, the local station.